Here's an absolutely marvellous Panatus batfish. Now these grow into a beautifully round, monstrous fish. Um, as a juvenile, they're just absolutely spectacular. As you can see, this one here is pretty much spanning from the bottom of the t to the top of the tank. So it's not far under 30 centimetres tall, and most of it's fin. Because if you see how the size of its actual body is not that big. Now they're typically quite hard to keep. Because when they're young, they're just way too timid. So therefore they just don't seem to compete well for food. But in saying that, when you do get a good one, they're absolutely ravishing. Though I've had them follow my finger, chase you up and down the tank. Highly intelligent, um, beautifully integrated fish that um, is like a real pet. And they grow very fast. So that's something you need to bear in mind if you want to buy one. But they're definitely challenging. So there's only a fish that you want to take on if you're ready for a challenge. Because they're not necessarily easy to keep. But I mean they're so gorgeous that it's tempting to try. I mean if you can settle them in a relatively busy tank with um, other slow feeding fish to allow it to um, get used to you and the environment then that would be really good. But with really fast feeding wrasse and tangs and things they just don't compete. But once they do find their feet they get used to the tank, they get used to you, they start feeding, they'll compete with anything. And you won't believe what this looks like as an adult. It's completely different. Perfect fish if you're looking for a challenge. Not for beginners. Sort of um, camouflage like a big piece of seaweed. Magnificent thing.